Well, hello. I've uh, been busy this week. I've been working on the yearbook, of course, and I've been trying to get my garden dug up, and it hasn't been easy because between yearbook, my other obligations, and the fact that I was sick, I am behind. I should have everything dug up by now, and I don't. But I'm going to take you around to show you what's going on with the garden. So we'll take you outside here. Uh, one thing that's totally not garden related, I am not under a power line, I am not under a tree, but birds are using my car for target practice and I'm not happy about that. But let's walk over to the garden because that's something I'm somewhat happy about. Nothing's planted yet, but right here, right there was not garden last year it is this year uh, that was garden that was a new bed i added last year i'm going to actually at some point after my shoulder heals up dig that up that's going to be another bed that'll be flowers because it's right by the road so got this dug up rhubarb plant is healthy it's a shame i don't really eat much sweet stuff because you know it's rhubarb so this is all stuff I added last year. And then just dug up that half today. Uh, my shoulder started hurting and a couple of years ago I broke it. So uh, I thought, eh, taking a break. So hopefully I can get back out here and finish digging this bed. But you can see what happened since I got behind on all the digging. Volunteers moved in. Not thrilled with that. So it's going to be a little bit more work getting this ready, but I'll get there. One thing kind of fun, I don't think I've taken you inside my garden shed, but I bought a lawn mower. Uh, the old one, which my parents bought in 1983, bit the dust. So I bought this. A real lawn mower. Real in both senses, both with the double E and with the EA. <laughs> kind of cool. Uh, and it does a pretty good job. I mean, I just cut this lawn yesterday. It's looking good. Uh, I'm going to take you around the north side of the house this time. There's my rain barrel. North side of the house because, yes, I'll admit it, I need to trim. That's another one of those jobs that normally I would have done by now and haven't. Maybe I should do that instead of filming this video. <laughs> but anyway, some plants ready to put in. I might actually, if my shoulder keeps hurting, I might actually put some of these in tonight just uh, so I do something. <laughs> this bed my mother dug up last year, she'd hate to see it right now when it's full of weeds, but she put in a bunch of plants she brought, so I ne really need to weed it, but I thought I gotta get that garden done. And there's some more plants on the front steps. And another bed I need to dig. I think it's kind of cool how the hosta has spread finally. Or not hosta, what is that? Drawn a blank right now. Anyway, oh, uh, apparently I need to pick up the rug there and the plastic jug. But anyway, another thing once I trim, and I think I'm going to put Roundup right along the edge of that, just because I don't like trimming. <laughs> All right, on this side, I planted this tree last year. My parents actually rescued it from here, and then they brought it back after a few years. So... Other than the top being missing after winter, it's looking good. Uh, here, I haven't done anything to this bed yet, but this thing needs to get pulled like now before it flowers. Oops. Ooh, that's in there. There we go. Look at that tap rut. <laughs> that makes like dandelion flowers, but worse. And normally this would be dug up already, but again, I was sick, 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 sick. Chives. The only thing here, uh, last year my neighbor brought me a bunch of leaves and you know lawn refuse which are buried in there. So when I get this dug up that'll be good. And then there's a volunteer tree. I need to trim around him. I'm, oops, I'm in his light. I clearly can't use round up there. So I'll just trim. I've got garden shears. Uh, the lilacs are almost done but they were quite impressive this year. I mean, look at that. <laughs> um, pretty happy with how the house still looks. And over here, yes, I need to trim again. 
Um, this needs to be dug up. I don't have good success with this bed. I think it's close to the house, so it plants struggle here anyway. So I'll figure something out eventually. And these guys are about to flower, and it, part of me thinks, why not spread them into that bed? Which I may do. We'll see. House-wise, I am seeing some work that needs to be done there. You know, the trouble is that board just needs to be taken out and replaced. There's some rot there. And uh, that one wouldn't be too bad to do. There's one over here on the kitchen that, ugh. So yeah, some trim that needs to be repainted. This one though, this one's gonna be a bugger. Um, I can see where they've, previous owners have done some stuff that wasn't exactly a permanent solution. Not thrilled by that, so something else to do. So anyway, that's where I'm at with the garden. I'm uh, working on it. I'm not there yet. And uh, yeah, don't get sick in the spring. That's my only advice. So uh, I'm also thinking how many more years am I going to be digging up the garden by hand? And so we'll see. Anyway, thank you for watching. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.